live from Bethesda, Maryland, where the winters are hard and the cookies are soft. This is the Robert Dyer Channel Christmas Countdown 2021. And now, here's a man who remembers when Christmas Crunch came with a present glued to the box, Robert Dyer. Hi everybody, Robert Dyer and welcome, welcome to the Robert Dyer Channel Christmas Countdown, where today I have what's probably one of the most exciting products coming out for Christmas this year. I know the Mountain Dew uh, gingerbread snap was one of them. Gingerbread seems to be one of the stronger themes this year, and I'm not complaining because I do like gingerbread very much. But here we have from a big name the limited edition gingerbread Oreo with five festive designs. Okay, so here's a closer look at the packaging and it's fairly elaborate uh, in the design. You can see the famous Nabisco logo up in the upper left corner. Limited edition gingerbread. And then you have some finer details here. And you have some snowflakes falling. Different shapes and sizes. You notice the gingerbread font so to speak is a kind of a frosted gingerbread look to it then you have this gingerbread house with the icing gingerbread flavored cookie naturally and artificially flavored cream with crunchy sugar crystals and then here it is over here and it says up here five festive designs and there we see some Christmas trees in the background and the snow and here is one of the five is the gingerbread man himself with a little bow tie there and here you can see the gingerbread cookie as well as the so-called crunchy sugar crystals those red splotches in there and then here on the back while they don't tell you anything to convince you to buy the product they do show you the five designs so you have the Christmas tree here it looks like some ornaments hanging down on either side doesn't make a whole lot of sense they're supposed to be on the tree you have Oreo Joy you have the gingerbread man we saw in the front Oreos for Santa. I guess this is the one you put out on the plate with the milk by the fireplace. And then finally you have a gingerbread house with a couple of stones on the walk coming up to the front door. And then you've got a couple of snowflakes falling here in the International Mega Corporation boardroom. Then we take a look at the nutrition facts. You're supposed to get two cookies. And so the numbers don't look that bad when you're just eating two. But how many of us other than Richard Simmons are only going to eat two of these? 20 milligrams of potassium for the day. First ingredient, sugar. See it says molasses, and brown ginger cinnamon those are the identifiable food ingredients and fortunately this is apparently made in the USA so here I've got one out of the package and just randomly coincidentally it's that disassembled gingerbread man we saw so many times on the package the aroma surprisingly not that strong compared to your typical ginger snap ginger man cookie it smells more just like the standard Oreo like the vanilla one or something 
definitely not strong at all. Now I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to taste the cookie and the filling separately and then we'll put it together for the real experience. Let's go ahead and see how it tastes. It's tending more towards a graham cracker than a gingerbread man, I would say. Now that's a pretty weak gingerbread flavor. Here you can maybe see the little red sugar crystals they're talking about. I'm not exactly sure what the meaning of it is, other than that red is a Christmas color. Well, you definitely get a little extra crunch out of those sugar crystals, but they're not doing much for the flavor here. Now let's try the sandwich. I think the real news was that Trump has blocked Don Jr. on his phone. Maybe Trump is even smarter than we thought. I'm here right now at the IHOP in Willoughby, Ohio, where there was a lot of controversy, people protesting outside. Joe Biden had given away too much money and people don't want to work anymore. Now there's a boycott starting online. I ordered a short stack of the Winter Wonderland pancakes, a frozen hot chocolate shake, and a burger with melted Swiss cheese, roasted mushrooms, and caramelized onions. That is hot stuff. You can get that at a number of different places including right here at IHOP, it turns out. This might be time for those uh, going bananas gingerbread men from the Mountain Dew can to start coming out. I think the flavor was quite weak. The cookie was not as spicy and didn't have that zing that you get from a real gingerbread cookie. Uh, I think the one thing they did right was that the filling is, to me, it seemed like it was rather than the standard Oreo filling that it had more of the flavor that the icing on gingerbread would have. But ultimately that doesn't really matter so much because you're ending up with sort of, in my opinion, a kind of a slightly gingery graham cracker Oreo. Now the other thing they did very well was having those designs on the five different designs on the cookies and some pretty good packaging especially as far as Oreos go but I just think it was the ginger flavor was so disappointing that I think this might anger a gingerbread man. They really had to deliver on that gingerbread flavor and in my opinion it did not so with the disappointment failing to deliver the gingerbread flavor promised, I think it technically should be two stars out of five, but because of those nice designs, if you can put those out, whether it's a Christmas party or it's just out on a plate when you're watching the Christmas movies, I think it's, uh, and not to mention put out for Santa Claus, the ones that say for Santa, uh, I think I feel justified in bumping it up in the Christmas spirit once again to three stars out of five. You'll just be somewhat adequately satisfied, I think, with the overall product here but it's not going to be something you remember five years from now that you had for Christmas in 2021. Hope you like this video. Share it with your friends. Please subscribe, and I'll see you next time.
tomorrow on this Christmas countdown. Bye everybody.